Win. All right, so here we are at NAM with Scott. Scott, what's right, up, yep, guys? Right here, what's up? I was on a radio show. Yeah, what are we doing? Same job. Yo, how was your day going? Uh, pretty good. good. What are you flying for today? Uh, came from local Las Vegas, so like a 38 minute flight. Not bad. You get to Orange County, and then you got to drive up here. But yeah, I wasn't bad. I wasn't driving. What you been up to, man? What's been wrong in the music world? Uh, well, I'll get Kingdom Come still going. Uh, people know James Kotek fans. Yeah, I was um, ask. He's been taking a leave of absence, and Las Elias from Slaughter, who's a good friend, has been filling in for him in the meantime. Uh, which has been going great. Loss is also playing Raiding the Rock Vault with me in Las Vegas. Uh, so we see each other quite often. And uh, he's also playing on some of my solo stuff. So we're working that out. Um, I don't know if you guys are familiar with Raiding the Rock Vault. No. So it's a rock and roll show in Las Vegas that takes you on a history tour from the 60s, like The Who, The Doors, and The Stones, and then it goes into... Really? And then finally winds up in the 80s with you know White Snake and Dev Leppard and Ben Halen and and, uh, and that kind of thing. And it's a show. It's got narration and multiple video screens. And it's been around 10 years. And they've been voted the best show in Vegas nine years in a row. Um, and so it's, I'm singing in it. Bruce is singing in it from Slash's band. And um, so sometimes we have Jizzy Pearl singing in it from Rat and Quiet okay. Riot and sometimes we have only Logan singing in it and um, we got a, a new kid named Travis Cormier who's a Canadian guy and had some albums out up in Canada who also comes in and sings uh, the lovely Georgia Napolitano girl from the Trans-Siberian Orchestra comes in and she's the female singer and you know sometimes people come and go Rowan Robertson is playing guitar. Uh, he plays the double neck. Does the uh, does the double neck, the red one on on the on the Led Zeppelin stuff, and the oh, white really? one on the uh, on the, the Eagles stuff that we do. So it goes chronologically, you guys come out and do like this. Exactly. Yeah, goes 60s and the 70s, 80s. Right. And right. So it's all different modes. You guys dress differently in for each one. I think I'm the one that changes the most. That's what they say. <laughs> so like, also, you can wait to see what Keith's going to be wearing today. <laughs> you know, you try to mix it up. Yourself to like entertain, you know, back there. Like, so he does some cool stuff with Ron Kool too out of Amsterdam. Ron Kool and yes, is yes, coming a uh, uh, Dutch, Dutch artist who's amazing. He started out as a drummer, but he was also always kind of a songwriter, and he started playing guitar, kind of like Ryan Tishy did, right? And um, but now you know he's writing on guitar, so we've co-written a bunch of songs. We already did one record. Uh, called Rise mm -hmm. that he just kind of released and kind of we played that we played, we played a Paradise <laughs> song yeah but he kind of slow played that a little bit compared to the new record um, the new single is coming out really soon it's called Heavy Metal Till I'm Dead um, you know uh, it, it sounds like a very presumptuous title you know like what kind of balls does this guy have but when you hear the song I think you'll get it <laughs> it's, it's well, really can't wait. anthemic I think it's May 5th if it's not the 5th it's like the Sixth or the fourth, but look for May fifth. Heavy metal when I'm dead. Ron Coolin, just like cool with an E N. Ron Coolin, and uh, yeah, some of the stuff I've been writing. We got a record, a whole record coming out that that's a part of. Um, I'm working with another guy in France. Uh, can't say much about it. Uh, great guitar player. He's a big Doug Aldridge fan and all that style of guitar playing. But he's written some really cool songs, and we have a thing coming out. With burning rain. Uh, burning rain is stuff. still going, but you, you're, you got your hands full. Yeah, well, well, like well <laughs> Doug's in the Dead Daisies. You know, he's, he's not able to do. He doesn't. You know, they, that band is very busy, so he just doesn't have time to do that much stuff. And so, you know, I'm keeping myself busy. I'm writing with other people. I got my own stuff coming out. Um, Kingdom Come still going. Raiding the Rock Falls going. Yeah. yeah, a little busy. It's a lot happening. That's cool. Man. And the commute back and forth from. Uh, you know, I'm going down Laguna Beach now, and I can do back and forth to Las Vegas. So. Got my place in Henderson. Oh, yeah. All right. And, uh, you know, I've gotten to know a lot of the Vegas people, which a ton of L.A. people have moved down to Vegas during the pandemic and whatnot. Right. There's a ton of people live out there. I mean, Eric <laughs> Singer lives out there. Really? Uh, Ratchet, you know, from Steel Panther. Like a bunch, like tons of people. The community I just moved out I didn't Vegas. know Jizzy was out there. I'm like, <laughs> Jizzy, you live out there? I'm like the only guy that doesn't like officially live out there. <laughs> Close. 
But uh, it's really good to hook up with you guys. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, we've been supporting you and uh, I hope you stuff for years. I hope your world stays rocking. Oh, yeah. Too. I got dinner people calling me and calling me. You can hear my phone going up in the back <laughs> pocket. Thank you. Where the F is he? But right. I'm glad I ran out to you guys out yeah. here. Thank you. Right. Thank, Thank you. you. He's got plow, the plow zone right here. Keep it going. Plow zone. Keep it going. All right. Yeah. Woo.